，休斯顿亚裔商会二零一五年的第一次午餐会于本周一举行，主题为“移民的现状及对商业的影响”。主讲人是休斯顿著名律师 Foster 公司主席 Charles Foster 和休斯顿纪事报公共政策专栏作家 Bill King。当天，大休斯顿地区商企业代表共计约六十人参加。休斯顿亚裔商会这次月会主要讨论移民对美国经济和商业的影响。亚裔商会总裁 Linda Toyota 强调，亚裔商会作为大休斯顿地区第二大少数族裔商会，致力于促进休斯顿亚裔社区的经济发展，并帮助商家企业搭建平台，促进企业成长。We hold monthly meetings to keep our members and guests updated of critical issues affecting our community and the business community. Immigration has been an issue for so long, so we have experts that are going to share their knowledge and wisdom to explain misinformation that's out in the community, and to also address issues of how we, as business people, can have a voice. In terms of where we see the importance of immigration, and so that is the purpose of the Asian Chamber: to give access to resources, communicating key issues, and connecting people to business people. 参会上由休斯顿商业周刊发行人 John Bellow 介绍主讲人。主讲人 Charles Foster 首先发言。他认为美国的强大和发展离不开移民的贡献。从一九六五年移民法改革以来，中国人对美国的经济起到了不可或缺的巨大影响。来自中国的新移民和在美华人是人口增长最快速的族群之一。不仅在休斯顿地区如此，在全美来看也是如此。越来越多的美籍华人担任领导角色，尤其是华裔第二代，更是对美国经济起到正面作用。特别是在中美双边经贸发展中起到的推动作用。他认为，去年十一月由奥巴马总统提出的移民行政命令是一项非常重要举措。U.S. has always benefited from immigrants wherever they're from, and we have large numbers of immigrants down from Asia. At the top of the food chain, the highly educated. Uh, it's very important that we we have a functioning legal system. I'm speaking about President Obama's executive actions of November 20th. It will help highly skilled individuals from Asia stay here, and will also help those people doing all the work we don't want to do, that are here for a long time with children, undocumented, to acquire a semi-legal status. So it's very important. And everyone should take advantage of that if they if they can qualify for deferred action under President Obama's executive actions. 休斯顿纪事报公共政策专栏作家 Bill King 接着讲道，追溯历史起源，美国人原本就是来自欧洲国家的移民。美国是一个自由民主的国家，没有任何一个国家像美国一样提供人们平等自由的商业发展机会。与此同时。来自世界各个族裔的移民，也使美国在政治、经济、人文等方面都变得更加强大。What's always made this country strong,、uh, both politically,、uh, morally, and economically, is the fact that we've had the best and the brightest from all over the world choose to come here. Uh, and 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 in the early days, it was the bravest, the ones that were willing to brave the North Atlantic and come across from Europe. Uh, but we are the we're the ultimate melting pot of the world, and there's no other country like this in the world. There's no other country where people see it as a beacon of freedom and economic opportunity. 演讲结束后，两位主讲人接受与会者提问，交流互换意见。最后，亚裔商会董事会成员赠送礼品给三位嘉宾。